are? Uh, I play Macduff. Macduff is not the protagonist of the play, but he is the hero in the sense that he, you know, does the, what you see the descent of somebody who is starts out as a good man. Macbeth doesn't start out as a monster, but you see his slow descent into the most e evil of evil realms that a person can go to. And because and, why? And because of his, you know, unending, bottomless lust for power, uh, for control. Uh, that's how it starts out. But he ends up doing evil things almost purely for the sake of evil. You are a very successful actor. Your, I mean, your career has gone great. How do you fight off that, uh, the tendency to be, I mean, not the tendency, the, the temptation to become a megalomaniac, to become mm. obsessed with getting the next part, uh, you know, becoming obsessive about success? Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, like, to answer that question in the way that you asked, it would suggest that I have not been susceptible to my own. Yes, I don't know you. Yeah. You could be a son of a bitch. Yeah, you yeah. could be a total jerk, <laughs> <laughs> and I am. No, um, no. I mean, I, I don't know. I guess you know your, your own narcissism, your own conceit, your own arrogance, your own in, in distorted, maybe over exaggerated sense of self is something that you constantly have to try to be on top of, whether you're an actor or whether you're just, you know, whether you do something else for a living. So you know, I, I try, but I'm sure that I have my moments. If you talk to those who know me and love me, they're probably like, "Yeah, Daniel really sometimes is up his own." <laughs> I'm not a good um, guy. I just play one on television. I just play one on television. <laughs> yeah.